weather channel lady. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I came to the outlet mall. I am going to be doing a shopping trip plus a try-on haul for H&M. I'm also gonna go ahead and try to do like a budget-friendly H&M haul, but I can't guarantee it might be under, it might be over. So the try-on haul part I am gonna do at home though because there's some stores that aren't allowing us to like try on in the fitting room. So that I'm gonna have to do at home. And about two weeks ago I came to H&M and I just wanted to buy everything. I thought everything was cute. So this is where I got this idea of doing this haul. So I really hope you guys enjoy. Just keep on watching and let's go. H&M. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what I got. It's about six outfits. Some of these I'm gonna have to add my own shorts. I'm very picky. I didn't want to get shorts or jeans from H&M just because again I am really picky when it comes to my bottoms and I tried to stay in the like summer outfits kind of area but I did stray away to sections of H&M that had sales for winter. I did get two things, but I didn't include it in the $100. And not to mention, I didn't even spend $100. It came out to $79.14. I really didn't think that was bad. And then again, I did go back and get two other things that were in the winter section that only came out to $7.91. I'll go ahead and show you guys that. I want to say towards the end, I counted and it was up to $77. So that left me with like still $13 to spend. So what I did is I went to go and find some shorts which were $12.99, literally $13. I knew I was gonna go over by like tax wise. And speaking of tax, it turned out to be that it's tax free weekend. Yeah! Now let me tell you as to why it came out to $79. Why did it come out to $79? Oh, okay, so because I'm a member, I got 10% off and they also had a coupon for 20% off and I don't know if that's because it was the outlet mall. So technically it came out to me having 30% off. Oh yeah, so here the whole total came out to 109. Oh wow, I would have been like $9 over. Also, I did try to get out of my comfort zone as far as like not getting neutral colors like white and black, but that didn't happen. I ended up getting like a black shirt. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys first what I got and then I'll go ahead and show you guys what it looks like on me. I also had to change my shirt because I spilled coffee on it, so yeah. And I'll just go ahead and start off with this black tank. I like it because I can just go ahead and put this on with jeans or shorts. And this one came out to $9.99. Next thing I got was this bodysuit. So cool thing about this is that it was $2.00. I was really shocked. It doesn't have the sticker on here, but it had a sticker on the other size, but the other size was bigger and I had to get this size. I've really been into like bodysuits lately. I can wear them with high-waisted jeans or even high-waisted shorts. So that was really cute. And then to go with these two, I did go ahead and get these very pajama looking shorts, but I mean, I would so wear this to a wedding. But I would just wear these anywhere. I mean, I don't really go anywhere. I thought these were really cute. And these ones came out to $12.99. And they're in the army green color. So I don't have any like this. So I'm glad I got these. And then next, I got this cute little nude crop top. And it was $4.99. Yeah, it was $4.99. And with this tank, I did want to pair it up with these cute little shorts. So these ones were $12.99. These ones are more like to wear out and I love how it has pockets. And this color I thought would look really cute with the nude tank. So I got those. Next, I got this shirt and this is where I mentioned I'm going to use my own shorts because I didn't get any there. 
This is just an oversized shirt. It was $5. Next, I got this cute romper. This one was $17.99. Thought it was really cute. And it has pockets. Next, I got another cute white tank crop top. This one was $5.99. And with this, I am going to pair it with these cute little Hawaii flower vibes shorts. I was really nervous about these. Like I mentioned, I am very picky when it comes to my bottoms. So when I do try them on right now, I'm hoping they fit cute on me. If not, I might have to return those. I've been really into the sheared vibe. And this one came out to $2. And I don't think there was another color. I want to say I saw another color, but I can't remember. But I'm glad I got this one because nude, my comfort zone. And lastly, what I got was this cute button-down black skirt. I'm going to pair it with this sheared crop top. And it came out to $12.99. This is where I told myself I only had $13 left. So when I went to go and look for this, it came out to $12.99. And I was just like barely going to pass my budget line. So $79.14 for this, which I thought was really good. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the last two items that I went to go and run for. I got this hoodie. And it's oversized. This one came out to... $8. And then lastly, I got this cute off the shoulder pink sweater. You guys won't believe how much this one was. It doesn't have it on here, but it was scanned by the cashier and it came out to $3 compared to $14.99. You guys need to like make an H&M trip ASAP. Like this video is going up on Tuesday. You guys need to go Wednesday. Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and try these on just so you guys see what they look on me. Let's go. Okay, so I did go ahead and put on the first outfit. The shorts are so comfortable. They're very sweatpants kind of material. They have pockets, which I really like, so I can put my phone. It has like this little string, so of course, like if they're too tight or too loose, you can tighten them up. But these honestly fit me just right. And, and this black tank, I should have got more colors, but now that I remember, there was no other colors in my size. Okay, so let's move on. Okay, so now this is the shorts with the bodysuit. I really, really like it. Let's just compliment these shorts again because I just think they're so cute. They're very comfortable. Honestly, don't even want to take them off. There's really not too much to say about this bodysuit. It's very comfortable, very casual, very clean. And let's go ahead and move on. Okay, so another very casual outfit. They're a little bit wrinkled just because they were thrown in the bag, but I love this tank and these shorts. They just go so well together. These ones also have pockets and this cute little lace. So of course, if they're too tight or too loose, you just tighten them. Now moving on. Okay, so next outfit, I did go ahead and add my American Eagle shorts. And I did have to leave on the nude tank just because without it, it's just literally showing everything. You can also go ahead and wear this with your bathing suit underneath. So this is a very like throw over your bathing suit kind of shirt as well. Now, moving on. So this is the romper with the floral on it. And honestly, it's really, really cute. I like it. I love how it has pockets and to be honest when I was picking it out I didn't even notice if it had pockets or not but pockets to me are a big plus I love pockets I've already mentioned that like a thousand times and honestly it's giving me a dress look kind of vibe Okay, so this was the outfit I was most nervous about. I even feel like these shorts give me pajama vibes, <laughs> but again, it also gives me summer vibes. I am a big, big fan of this white tank. It has this cute little accent on the top of the tank. I am definitely not a fan of these shorts, that's for sure. I can already tell they just fit me very weird. I mean, I don't know. What do you guys think? Comment down below. 
if this is a cute outfit or not, I can tell you right off the bat, I am not a fan, I don't like it. The top I do though, that's for sure. Other than that, I will majorly pass on these shorts. So I don't want to sound like a party pooper on those other shorts, but I did also get these at American Eagle and I just wanted to show what an outfit would look like with this tank. And this is perfect. I really do think this outfit goes. So this is definitely a summer outfit and I really like it. Okay, so last outfit. And right off the bat, I can already tell you that this skirt is a little too tight, but I really, really, really like it. I love the button down of it and also this sheer top I really thought was going to be more crop but I did have to tuck it in. This is what it looks like tucked out. I am going to go ahead and try it on with the black American Eagle shorts and let's see how that looks. So this is how this top looks with these high-waisted black shorts. I mean you obviously can't see that they're high-waisted. Like I mentioned I really did think that this shirt was going to be more crop but it's totally fine. So I think it's really cute. It's definitely very casual and that's my type of scene, so I am all for it. Okay, so this is the oversized hoodie and I do like and didn't even realize that this hooded sweater has pockets. So that is so cool. I also did add my black shorts underneath just in case. I'm for it and I'm not for it. Comment down below because I need your guys' help if this is a fit or not. Okay, and this is the pink off the shoulder sweater. I definitely do like this sweater. It's very comfortable. I did go ahead and add the black high-waisted shorts. All right, everyone, so that is it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you like watching videos like this, definitely let me know in the comments down below. I'll be more than happy to film more of them like this. It was a lot of fun. And before you guys go, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell right next to it. That way you get notified every time I post a new video. Thank you guys again so much for watching, and I will see you on the next one.